medical system is one of the world's oldest known medical tradition, with the history going back to approximately 2,500 years. During the 7th century, the King Songsen Gampu invited physicians from India, Nepal, Persia, and China to Tibet to discuss the medical system. Yutho Yuntien Kombu founded the first Tibetan medical school in Gongpo, Tibet in the year 762. Tibetan medicine, which has been highly respected throughout Asia for many, many centuries, is now engendering great interest all over the world. Amchikunga Chodak begins his daily rituals by praying to God for every human being's good health and long lives. Being a Buddhist, he wishes for everyone's well-beings by prostrating every single morning and by reading out prayers from the Tibetan prayer book. After dedicating himself a few hours to the spiritual side of his life, he finally starts seeing his patients and gives them the best care possible. Anjikungachitalana Memba ตาตุนเดยอชุสนะตาอันซะกะละกะตาอ่าอารองนี่ชิชนะตันเดเรอารองซุซุกิตาอันดุยอ่าชิบลอจงยอชบตาจิงารองตุนเดทันซุซอย
that is a spreading to bones and I have limping legs, my right leg. I could not walk. And the top uh, doctor at Princess Margaret Hospital making tests on my prostate cancer say that in the similar case like me, I'm left to 12 or 16 months to live. I mean, I'm supposed to die after 16 months. Then by around February 2008, I take medicine from Dr. Shodak, and I understand that is from Tibet's medicines. And gradually, I see that my sickness disappear, and I'm nearly cured today. Oh. Only through the medicine from Dr. Shodak that I'm getting cured. I wish secretly that Dr. Shodak can be in a position where he can cure um, terminal sickness like uh, cancer, and many people can profit from Tibet medicines. I am from Ethiopia. I already his uh, Amchis uh, medicine. Then uh, when I told him that I was sick, he uh, he took me to his clinic, and I, I got my treatment. So after I had this treatment, I had a good result. Um, I was so happy that um, I took also other friends to uh, Amchi Kunga to try the Tibetan medicine. And uh, yeah, and I, advise, and I advise other people to do so. My name is Mary Kangas, and I'm from Sudbury, Ontario. About two and a half years ago, I became quite ill with an autoimmune disorder, and uh, medicine seemed to have made me even, uh, the side effects made me even more sick. So I was looking for an alternative to a uh, solution to my problem. And that's when a friend of mine uh, suggested that I see Dr. Uh, Kunga, I'm Chikunga, and uh, that's when I came to see him and have been very happy with his treatment. Oh, fantastic. I just feel fabulous now compared to how I felt then. I had lost a lot of weight, I was very ill, and I feel great now. Uh, the medicine was uh, uh, easy to take. Uh, it's, uh, it worked gradually, and, uh, and it really, uh, no side effects whatsoever, and I feel great right now. Well, I would recommend people to try Tibetan medicine. It's an old medicine and proved medicine, and uh, I know it worked for me, and quite a few people that I know that it worked for quite well, so I would definitely recommend uh, people uh, to, to see. <laughs>